Fat boy happy. So good. Wait, are you gonna put me online? So, 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 so. Met men behind me right there. Big one, really big one, big store. And lucky enough, we can bring the camera inside. So we film a little bit. They have like all this cool and very good looking marijuana stuff, like legal one. This is the pre-rolls. The Zen. Yeah, the Zen one, which actually made for enlightenment. It's more sativa hybrid. So yeah, they have all this like very cool looking stuff. I, I've, I've never seen like that good looking in... Zen or brought you to, or brought you to, to a nice place in California. <laughs> this is our first time Whoa. trying products from another state, from another recreational state. So it's made here in Nevada? Yeah, because it's against the law to bring it from another state. It's federal cross trafficking. Oops. Let's open this pre roll thing. You can't open it. I'm trying to. Oh, there you go. Ah. And then you fold it up. Ooh, fancy. Yeah. And also, let me see the other thing. See how cool this is? The way you open it. Uh, this. We can do it like. Push the two clips together. Mm -hmm. And then it pops out. So the zipper has a cool. clip. Cool. Open it. What is yeah. the other thing in there? It's there. The yeah. So how much is this? 45? Yeah. The most expensive thing. <laughs> Quick, we sit at the Mad Men. That was nice to see. I've never been in something like that before. Also in Thailand, I would be put in jail already if I even smell like one or have like this small little bit with me. Federally illegal. Yeah, in Thailand. That's crazy and people smoke it here legally everywhere we are actually going for the second meal of the day this evening just right when we arrived we went there the white castle but then just actually like one minute or less from the White Castle on Paradise Street We have this place called Fries and Pies I was not gonna film this because we just back from the strip a little bit tipsy and a little bit We got kind of hungry and then we're just looking around for like some random stuff and any pizza or wings or whatever There's something special about this place that is why I ran all the way up to the room to get this camera. Oh. Perfect timing. Oh, would you guys like ranch or anything? Or? Yes, please. Oh, no. So good. Eat him. For you. Like ran to the gravy too. Yeah. Are my new favorite fries. <laughs> Yeah, so Eyes what I yeah. <laughs> so what I told you before that why I had to run like crazy back to the hotel and then come back here to show you how special this special recipe. But you have to see like the flavor, how they have Californian like ranch cream cheese, mozzarella, chicken, bacon, tomato, avocado on top. Like the sign right there, you can see like this flavor that like, can be put on the salad the pizza or the fry to make it poutine, like Canadian style kind of stuff. Philly cheese steak, beef gravy, cheddar steak, grilled onions, mushroom, peppers, mozzarella, cream cheese sauce. So all on that, on the fries. Eight dollars for the small one. Mm, the real poutine. 
You also put like gravy on here also. That's why they give it to us. Do you want it on here? No, there's a gravy on it. Oh, that's such a big piece. I think that makes it like um more flavorful and give some varieties of the taste. This is like so good already. Oh. I didn't realize it was jalapeno cream cheese. My lips burning and I was like, what's up? Habanero cream cheese. Why spicy? Cheddar, mozzarella, pulled pork, bacon, and pineapple. The pizza, this one, the small one, cost us $14. Quite a good amount of stuff on here, actually. And Kevin love how like um the dough is so fluffy. Crust that's fluffy, doesn't fill you up. This is good. If you want crust fills you up. Go to other places. This one that I ordered actually a little bit spicy, like you have that that hint of spiciness in there because there's a habanero cream cheese. Oh, oh. <laughs> I like too. this. It's pretty yummy. Comes with shredded shredded pork on it. Mm -hmm. All right, now we going in like this. Now I'm going in. With my Hawaiian, spicy Hawaiian, with this cheesy kind of dipping. I think this is Thai style. Where people like ketchup and stuff. Really good. Mm. Ah. So we were a little bit hungry before, not so much, but you know, we, we kind of like have that munchies kind of thing. But that small pizza plus the small poutine, we like having a hard time finishing it because it seems like it's, it, it's small too, but like at the same time, it's a lot of food. The heat is kind of like getting on you a little bit because it really like burning my mouth right now. We done for the pizza. Place just right here. I like the place a lot because of how like creative they are on the menu. The chili steak that you can just put the whole lot of time even on pizza. What else? The weird. Oh, this one. Let me show you this. So you can actually have the Reuben sandwich on the pizza or on the poutine or on your salad. Like depends. One funny thing in that pizzeria. It's called like fries and pies. And Kevin was like, oh, I'm gonna get some pies. Like, at the end, he asked me if I want some pizza, and I said, yeah, but you want the pie? You can sort of the pie. I mean, if, if, if you like English speaking, that's... She didn't understand that the pie is the pizza. Yeah, because well, right pie... Right overhead, right overhead. 